In this video, I'll be showing you how to turn this into this in Blender. The method this tutorial uses is shape keys, and I'll use the ones that already come with the Fortnite rigs, so if you don't know how to get those, I'll leave links in the description on how to set up Fortnite porting. But in the last like, quarter of the video, I'll also teach you how to set up your own on your own rigs. So let's just get right into it. So first off, on your rig comes a pose mode up here, right? Uh, all controls I do will be in the bottom corner there and you may try to like grab the mouth I'm using IK rig by the way. It's just better if you think not then you're weird uh, You you can try to go like this and like play around with it and like You know go go like that and like it can work if you're okay at it like you just you just I'm no professional, but I mean you you can get it to look okay, but it's not the best way to do it. So, so for this method, you actually want to come out of post mode to so just come over here, go to object mode, and then you want to click on your armature. For this, I'm just going to turn off viewport uh, visibility stuff because it just gets in the way, in my opinion. So come down here into the data tab you'll see these these are shape keys these are what you want to use so basically what they do is they're like optional deformation De is that the word i don't even know they 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 deform the skin in edit mode itself so we'll find one that i want and once again these already come with the fortnite porting rigs they don't come with like every rig that you'll get from other things so i'll just yeah, our blink pose. So this will make the right eye blink most likely. Come down here to value. This controls how much deformation there is kind of. So one will be all the way. It makes it blink. And then zero is zero. So you can go anywhere halfway between. You can also keyframe it by hitting I. But that's useless in this tutorial. But yeah. So that's pretty much it. So I'm going to make like, should I, should I make a winking pose? No, I'm not doing that. But like, you, you can just like do these. <laughs> so yeah, you just find the ones you want. You play around with them. It's pretty easy. Like they're kind of just magic. So if I wanted to do Another thing with these is you can't edit them in edit mode themselves. Uh, sadly, you have to be in object mode, so you can't really see what what's happening. But if I come over here, I'm just gonna turn off bones, come into wireframe, you can kind of see what happens when I do this. It really is just edit mode working. Like, I'm gonna set the wire. Eh, never mind. Anyways, yeah, that's pretty much the whole tutorial for this half. Uh, you can also mix this if you turn on bones. You can still mix it with all of the like normal bones. So if you want the nose higher, go like that. If you want the jaw slightly open. <laughs> yeah, you can still do stuff. This tutorial is coming from someone who's not very good with Blender t or with Blender. But yeah, that's pretty much the whole thing for this half. So for the second part of this tutorial, uh, this is how to make your own shape keys. So come in here, you can just disable bones for now, like hide them. You really don't need them. I'm using the, the Marvel Rivals model because I don't have any of the good ones uh, right now. But so in here, if, if there's no shape keys on your model, make sure you're not in edit mode because then these are grayed out. Come in here, click it, and you'll see a basis. This is just your base model. Uh, that means everything else that you do, like, you can always go back to this. So come down here and rename it to whatever you want. So I'm gonna do like, like, mouth small. And then having this selected, come into edit mode, right? Just wanna find your mouth. 
so I'm just gonna go like go like that. I'm I'm not gonna do it perfectly for this tutorial. I just, I just wanna make sure there's no back faces. Yep, and I will. Boom. So now that I made the mouth smaller, you can come into here, and you can just adjust it like that and that's pretty much how you set up shape keys you can mix and match them so if I wanted to do another one called like I uh, I left or something I don't really know just come in here into edit mode make sure you're on this one select the two eyes so you go like this select the eyes and I'm just gonna turn them no nope, don't want proportional editing Oh, and I'm gonna set this to individual origins. Okay, so I'm just gonna go like that and move it over slightly. And then, boom, you have your eye control going left. And then you can mix it with the mouse small like that. And yeah, it's pretty much just how you set it up. I'm just gonna quickly set up one more just for the example. I just set up one more. So yeah, you, you can you can mix and match these just like like this, you know. Just like that. You know. Yeah, that's pretty much the whole tutorial. Uh uh I'll see you all in the next one. Uh peace.